Hey, the Gadget Man here with nothing but gadgets, and today we're going to be talking about this fuse bug, little portable battery powered bug zapper. So, three, two, one, let's get at it. All right, guys, so this is not a product that was sent to me. I saw an ad on YouTube for this thing, it was a like a major ad long all kinds of cool stuff in it and it was called for the fuse bug okay and i knew it was a scam but i let myself get scammed because i just wanted to do a review i went to youtube to look for other people that had reviewed this and i didn't see anybody that had done a good review on this product so for your sake i said i'm gonna let myself get scammed i know this isn't real but I want to test it out because you guys deserve to know the truth about the fuse bug. Okay, guys? So here's what it is. Um, this right here is not got fuse bug written anywhere on it. And uh, I'm kind of embarrassed to say that I got scammed for 60 bucks for this, this thing. Okay? All right. Now, it is a cool little device. And I don't know if it, is, it works. I am going to test it out to see if it does work. But if you look at this box, okay... It doesn't say fuse bug on it anywhere, okay? Nowhere. Actually, I found this on Wish.com for $14. Look at there. Okay, so it's not worth 60 bucks, not what I paid for it. Um, but, uh, you know, it is. <laughs> I don't know if it does work. We're going to test this baby out. So I'm going to test it, and I'm going to come back and show you whether this thing actually works or it doesn't work. I'm going to give you the lowdown on it, and we're going to see if it works. So... I'll be right back. All right, guys. So I'm back with the fuse bug results of my two-day testing on this thing. And let me tell you right now, I'm going to save you some time. If you don't want to watch the rest of this video, this is a scam. No big surprise there. I knew it was, but I went ahead and let myself get scammed because I wanted to warn you about this scam out there. And the reason I wanted to warn you is because these people have put together a very good ad that is quite deceptive and will attract a lot of people and fool a lot of people. And when I saw that ad, I said, I know that's a scam, but I want to warn people. So I went ahead and let myself become a willing victim of this scam for your sake. And I hope you appreciate it. Okay, guys, let me tell you right now, you're looking at these bugs on the table. After one full night in the forest next to a lake where there's a lot of mosquitoes, this is all this thing caught, okay? There's maybe two in here that I couldn't get out, but that is all that I got. And not one of these things is mosquitoes. Now on the Fusebug ad, and it doesn't matter if it's called Fusebug, there's like three or four different websites I was able to do research that have the same exact device right here, and they call them different things. So, but on the Fusebug ad, it's a very good ad, okay? So it starts out this nice story about a college student that loved to be on the outdoors but was allergic to mosquito bites, went to the doctor and got the disappointing news that doctors give, well, just don't get bit by mosquitoes. And he wasn't going to take that lane down. No, 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 no. He was going to solve a thousand-year-old or 10,000-year-old problem of mosquitoes. And he did research, scientific research, and he discovered the precise frequency of light that attracts mosquitoes, and he invented the fuse bug. And here's the deal. Here's the amazing, too, too good to be true thing that they said that will get you. And it was this, that if you turn this thing on, that it will kill all the mosquitoes in a 300 square foot area in six minutes. That's the claim. That's the claim when I said, okay, this is a scam because that's impossible. You're not going to invent it. Now, I mean, they had this commercial, this ad done up good. They had like awards. I mean, I'm surprised they didn't claim he got the Nobel Peace Prize because it was like he got the Academy of Science, International Academy of Science Award for Innovation and all these things. And millions of people are using this. And a whole bunch of lies, okay? Complete, total lies, okay? And uh, But I went ahead and bought it because I wanted to warn you. Okay, so it does not catch mosquitoes. That is a scam, so do not buy it for that. On the other hand, it does actually have some utility. This part of it right here, this little light doesn't do nothing. Um, it barely even kills bugs. Uh, the tons of bugs went on it, but didn't even kill them. 
Um, I never saw a mosquito attracted to it. But outside of that, it actually is a pretty good flashlight. Okay? You see that spot right there? At night, this is probably one of the brightest flashlights I've ever seen. I mean, I buy a lot of headlights and stuff because I do a lot of stuff outdoors. And this is probably one of the brightest, most concentrated focal beams at a distance that I've ever seen in a flashlight. Um, and so it was really cool. I was like, wow, if this were a flashlight, I would buy it for a flashlight because it's got this very focused beam, but it's got this overshadow here that lets you walk. But at 100 yards, this thing was like super bright and a very fine focus on, on the trees at 100 yards. Even 200 yards, it was still bright, okay? So that's actually pretty good. And it also doubles as a camping light because if you just keep pressing the button here, one, two, three, you've got this nice little camp light that you can hang up from a tree limb and in your tent. So it does have some utility. It's just the rest of it is kind of garbage. Now, I don't know about the solar panel. I didn't actually try that out, but if it could be charged, it'd be a nice little camping light. It's no good for bug killing, but it is good for a flashlight and for a camping light. So it's not that it's completely useless, but the ad claimed that it would kill all the mosquitoes in a 300 square foot area in six minutes. And that is a complete total lie and fabrication. It doesn't even kill mosquitoes as far as I can tell. It did kill some bugs, but no mosquitoes. All right, guys. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope that for your sake, me falling victim to this scam has been worth it to you. I appreciate it. Please like, subscribe to my channel. Until next time, this is the Gadget Man saying, I'll see you later.